and I got it. No bubbles. Mm. Ooh. Oh. Take a look how much longer it is comparing to my old one. A holder and Type-C USB cable. Nothing more. From one side of the LED bar we have Type-C input connector. This is 5 volt. It says 1 ampere. Here it is the microphone so can pick up some music or sound. And from this side we have on off switch, changing color and changing mode. And voila! Ooh, this is cool! Oh, this is beautiful. This one. Let's change it. You can also choose to be random changing color or patterns. Where is it? It's this one, yes. Let's change the color. Red. And here they in vertical position the old one is 15 centimeters height and this one is 30 centimeters I hook up my USB meter so I can monitor the the voltage and the milliampers that is pulling this gadget and while it's not working or not picking any sounds it's pulling 22 milliampers and when it's fully RGB LEDs from one side to the other side, it's around, it can consume around 100 or 120 milliampers. That is nothing. Okay, finally, bubbles. I love bubbles. Ooh. Okay, and here it is. instruction manual very short type C charging cable uh, I love this detail at gadget with transparent clear piece so you can see the integrated chips the LEDs and the printer sucker board I love that detail we have two magnets and type C charge charging port you can rotate like this so now we have the two strong LEDs at front also with these eight LED chips but you can rotate 180 degrees turning on and with one press you activate the front light and take a look at that display it shows 81 percent full one more time this is medium maybe blinking whoa this is crazy whoa you, you need to hold the button so you can activate these fronts and this is warm light Oh, I like warm red beautiful blue police light and turning off so you have a metal service and you want to attach it here you go how much milliampere is pulling while charging oh and beautiful we have a flashing charging sign on the display and it's pulling 700 milliampers 
that depends on how much capacity is the battery maybe it's bad maybe it's good all right how much is it 76 percent and this is my first very cool flashlight with rotatable front light which is nice function the LED display for showing how many how much percent is full the fully charged the battery with clip with magnet all right bubbles ooh ooh I like the sound of popping bubbles okay, okay. So for 9 US dollars you will get two 9 volt rechargeable batteries and this is something different. You will get this kind of charging cable type A from one side USB and two cables, short cables with type C connector for charging in the same time both batteries. That is nice. Okay. And the case is beautiful for keeping the 9 volt batteries. Here are they. Okay. Multimeter that is around 5 US dollars and it's auto. What it says? 9.2 volts. And the second one? 9.27. They are fully charged. Beautiful. With how many milliampers is charging the battery inside? What it says? 400 milliampers. That is around 2 watts. And where is the LED? Oh, it's in the connector. Rechargeable battery. But so you can see the real capacity of the lithium. I'm gonna do it. Finally, it's a big battery. Can you see it? Ooh. I need to be careful. And take a look at that. 1200 milliampers. 3.7 volts, 4400 milliwatts. This thing has the real capacity. I calculate 1100 milliampers, but the battery says it's 1200 milliampers. And each one costs around 4.5 US dollars. For 9 dollars, you will get two of them. The link will be in the description below so you can check it. And I expect to find some little battery inside, like tiny one, but this is good. And of course, I got it. Oh, no bubbles. So disappointed. But it's good that it comes in cardboard package. Oh, bubbles. Ooh, I received a very popular remote control and the cheap one. Here it is. The Ooh. some cables and nothing more and take a look at the panel at the middle we have the screen from the left side we have three buttons it says volume up play pause volume down next or previous track this one on the right side we have repeat, equalizer mode, we have infrared receiver right here, the logo for Bluetooth receiver, USB card reader, TF card reader and microphone, microphone input. 3, 2, 1. Oh. Flashing sign Bluetooth. When you press the mode, 
you go to FM receiver and also we have left and right LED equalizer or boom meter one more time AUX that is audio input and back to Bluetooth all right turning on AUX great first I'm gonna connect with my smartphone and here it is JQ D136BT I'm gonna connect it pairing yes okay and because of the copyright I need to use free YouTube audio library music why I don't hear nothing oh you need to volume up okay the volume up working volume down down working on testing test it's working yeah oh no is this working or not yes it's working fine and you can sing on your favorite songs my Singing skills are very bad. Next track. Working fine and great. Beautiful, beautiful. I ordered it and for the first time I received the product in this color, purple color. Okay. No bubbles. with 8x8 eight eight programmable RGB LED chips totally 64 chips that can be controlled through the Arduino board like this one I'm gonna use Arduino Uno you can find a link in description below so you can check it okay on the module we have positive input and negative and those wire I'm gonna hook up on the Arduino Arduino Uno board. You get some some kind of examples, and I'm gonna try the strand test. I have uploaded and take a look. It's working. I need to kill the light so you can see the effect better. Alright, let's try something else and take a look, new code, it's a smiley face with the eyes blinking and the mouth is also moving, beautiful. And by the way, you can use uh, AI to generate whatever you want, you go just to chat GPT, ask what you want and he will write the code in a couple of seconds lava effect which is good and now I'm gonna try the new code which is just a second to upload to the Arduino and it's a timer counting with not good numbers it's not expensive and it's a great toy and for learning Arduino and everything by the way you can make different projects like digital clock you can make a thermometer to be shown on this RGB LED matrix you can do a lot of projects alright if you like this video review of this module please give a like share and subscribe to my channel See ya!